advocate. To advocate a plan or idea is to support or suggest it in public. The group advocated increased spending on education and schools. Advocate. To advocate a plan or idea is to support or suggest it in public. The group advocated increased spending on education and schools. Advocate. To advocate a plan or idea is to support or suggest it in public. The group advocated increased spending on education and schools. Advocate. To advocate a plan or idea is to support or suggest it in public. The group advocated increased spending on education and schools. Authorize. To authorize something means to give permission for it. The mayor authorized the construction of a new statue in the park. Authorize. To authorize something means to give permission for it. The mayor authorized the construction of a new statue in the park. Authorize. To authorize something means to give permission for it. The mayor authorized the construction of a new statue in the park. Authorize. To authorize something means to give permission for it. The mayor authorized the construction of a new statue in the park. Civilian. A civilian is someone who is not in the military. It was Todd's job to keep civilians from entering the army facility. Civilian. A civilian is someone who is not in the military. It was Todd's job to keep civilians from entering the army facility. Civilian. A civilian is someone who is not in the military. It was Todd's job to keep civilians from entering the army facility. Civilian. A civilian is someone who is not in the military. It was Todd's job to keep civilians from entering the army facility. Commodity. A commodity is something that can be bought or sold. Fran's uncle made most of his money trading commodities. Commodity. A commodity is something that can be bought or sold. Fran's uncle made most of his money trading commodities. Commodity. A commodity is something that can be bought or sold. Fran's uncle made most of his money trading commodities. Commodity. A commodity is something that can be bought or sold. Fran's uncle made most of his money trading commodities. Conquest. A conquest is an event by which one country takes over another country. After the conquest, the people of the small city had no freedom. Conquest. A conquest is an event by which one country takes over another country. After the conquest, the people of the small city had no freedom. Conquest. A conquest is an event by which one country takes over another country. After the conquest, the people of the small city had no freedom. Conquest. A conquest is an event by which one country takes over another country. After the conquest, the people of the small city had no freedom. Disclose. To disclose something means to tell it to someone else. John came home late, so he had to disclose his activities to his wife. Disclose. To disclose something means to tell it to someone else. John came home late, so he had to disclose his activities to his wife. Disclose. To disclose something means to tell it to someone else. John came home late, so he had to disclose his activities to his wife. Disclose. To disclose something means to tell it to someone else.
John came home late, so he had to disclose his activities to his wife. Dynamics. The dynamics of a situation are the way that parts of it affect each other. A good psychologist needs to know a lot about the dynamics of brain disorders. Dynamics. The dynamics of a situation are the way that parts of it affect each other. A good psychologist needs to know a lot about the dynamics of brain disorders. Dynamics. The dynamics of a situation are the way that parts of it affect each other. A good psychologist needs to know a lot about the dynamics of brain disorders. Dynamics. The dynamics of a situation are the way that parts of it affect each other. A good psychologist needs to know a lot about the dynamics of brain disorders. Enroll. To enroll in something is to put one's name on a list as a member of a group. The students had to enroll in a class one semester in advance. Enroll. To enroll in something is to put one's name on a list as a member of a group. The students had to enroll in a class one semester in advance. Enroll. To enroll in something is to put one's name on a list as a member of a group. The students had to enroll in a class one semester in advance. Enroll. To enroll in something is to put one's name on a list as a member of a group. The students had to enroll in a class one semester in advance. Envious. When someone is envious, they want something that another person has. They were envious of their neighbor's front yard. Envious. When someone is envious, they want something that another person has. They were envious of their neighbor's front yard. Envious. When someone is envious, they want something that another person has. They were envious of their neighbor's front yard. Envious. When someone is envious, they want something that another person has. They were envious of their neighbor's front yard. Euphoria. Euphoria is a feeling of extreme happiness. The athlete felt euphoria after he won the important game. Euphoria. Euphoria is a feeling of extreme happiness. The athlete felt euphoria after he won the important game. Euphoria. Euphoria is a feeling of extreme happiness. The athlete felt euphoria after he won the important game. Euphoria. Euphoria is a feeling of extreme happiness. The athlete felt euphoria after he won the important game. Festive. When something is festive, it is happy and related to a party or celebration. Dean's favorite part of Christmas is the festive clothing that people wear. Festive. When something is festive, it is happy and related to a party or celebration. Dean's favorite part of Christmas is the festive clothing that people wear. Festive. When something is festive, it is happy and related to a party or celebration. Dean's favorite part of Christmas is the festive clothing that people wear. Festive. When something is festive, it is happy and related to a party or celebration. Dean's favorite part of Christmas is the festive clothing that people wear. Jolly. When someone is jolly, they are cheerful and happy. My grandmother's jolly attitude always made me smile. Jolly. When someone is jolly, they are cheerful and happy. My grandmother's jolly attitude always made me smile. Jolly. When someone is jolly, they are cheerful and happy. 
My grandmother's jolly attitude always made me smile. Jolly. When someone is jolly, they are cheerful and happy. My grandmother's jolly attitude always made me smile. Lentil. Lentils are very small beans that people cook and eat. Danny made her special soup with lentils when her husband was sick. Lentil. Lentils are very small beans that people cook and eat. Danny made her special soup with lentils when her husband was sick. Lentil. Lentils are very small beans that people cook and eat. Danny made her special soup with lentils when her husband was sick. Lentil. Lentils are very small beans that people cook and eat. Danny made her special soup with lentils when her husband was sick. Marshal. To marshal a group means to assemble them in order. The students were marshaled outside and put into groups. Marshal. To marshal a group means to assemble them in order. The students were marshaled outside and put into groups. Marshal. To marshal a group means to assemble them in order. The students were marshaled outside and put into groups. Marshal. To marshal a group means to assemble them in order. The students were marshaled outside and put into groups. Morale. Morale is the amount of hope that people have during a difficult situation. To improve our family's morale, Mom suggested going on a picnic. Morale. Morale is the amount of hope that people have during a difficult situation. To improve our family's morale, Mom suggested going on a picnic. Morale. Morale is the amount of hope that people have during a difficult situation. To improve our family's morale, Mom suggested going on a picnic. Morale. Morale is the amount of hope that people have during a difficult situation. To improve our family's morale, Mom suggested going on a picnic. Prophecy. A prophecy is a prediction about what will happen in the future. Some people believe that prophecies are actually true. Prophecy. A prophecy is a prediction about what will happen in the future. Some people believe that prophecies are actually true. Prophecy. A prophecy is a prediction about what will happen in the future. Some people believe that prophecies are actually true. Prophecy. A prophecy is a prediction about what will happen in the future. Some people believe that prophecies are actually true. Sage. A sage is someone who is very wise. Hal always visited the local sage for help with love. Sage. A sage is someone who is very wise. Hal always visited the local sage for help with love. Sage. A sage is someone who is very wise. Hal always visited the local sage for help with love. Sage. A sage is someone who is very wise. Hal always visited the local sage for help with love. Senate. A senate is a part of the government in some countries. Everybody liked Caroline and chose her to speak for them in the Senate. Senate. A senate is a part of the government in some countries. Everybody liked Caroline and chose her to speak for them in the Senate. Senate. A senate is a part of the government in some countries. Everybody liked Caroline and chose her to speak for them in the Senate. Senate. 
A Senate is a part of the government in some countries. Everybody liked Caroline and chose her to speak for them in the Senate. Sentiment. A sentiment is an opinion based on your feelings. Tess told everyone at the table her sentiments about eating meat. Sentiment. A sentiment is an opinion based on your feelings. Tess told everyone at the table her sentiments about eating meat. Sentiment. A sentiment is an opinion based on your feelings. Tess told everyone at the table her sentiments about eating meat. Sentiment. A sentiment is an opinion based on your feelings. Tess told everyone at the table her sentiments about eating meat. Unrest. Unrest is a state of anger about something among the people in a place. High taxes caused much of the unrest that led to the Revolutionary War. Unrest. Unrest is a state of anger about something among the people in a place. High taxes caused much of the unrest that led to the Revolutionary War.